Hey everyone, it's Lady Kako 1011 and today I'm going to be doing a review on Costume Ball Barbie. Um, I decided to do like a different thing because like you guys know I've been doing like the mystery thing where I put my hand in the bag and pull out a random doll but um, I decided to just like um, just do one doll per day like I've been doing but like I actually know which one I'm going to do so I'm going to do them in order like this. So yeah, and I decided to do Barbie first out of all the ones that I have left because all the ones I have left are brats So I thought I'd get Barbie out of the way and this doll is super pretty. I got her for $20 at Once Upon a Child, which is like a thrift store, but like only for like children, so that's really cool So you guys could t should totally check it out if you guys have one near you and this doll's from 1990 I believe which is quite old So I'm really excited to open her up. So let's look at her box down here says Costume Ball Barbie, her skirt is a mask for you. Three costume looks, ball gown, butter butterfly, and a fantasy flower. Cool. And of course it's made by Mattel. Welcome to the mask costume ball, Barbie says to her guests. Tonight is the night where you can dress like anything you want. Barbie has a magical costume that turns into a beautiful butterfly. No one will guess who I am, she says to herself, but a mysterious pirate keeps dancing with her. Who is he? Barbie wonders. I better change my costume before he guesses who I am. She changes to a flower, but when she gets back to the ballroom, the pirate is gone. Barbie dances with a handsome genie the rest of the night. He seems so familiar, she thinks. Soon it's midnight and the guests remove their masks. Why, it's you, Barbie exclaims, looking at smiling Ken. And Ken takes her hand, says, I knew the loveliest flower at the ball could only be you. How sweet. And of course, there's a picture of Barbie and Ken. There's also a costume ball of Ken, which looks super handsome. And there's like their different outfit combinations. So this doll looks super duper fun, and I can't wait to open her up. And yeah, let's open it up for you guys. Wow, who's that girl hiding behind that mask? Oh, it's Barbie. Here's Barbie. She is super pretty, and she is like so... Like, her dress is so, like, gaudy and pink and, and, like, ginormous. I love it. That's what I really love about, like, the 80s and early 90s Barbie dolls. Because they have, like, really poofy dresses and I love them. And they're so pretty. And, yeah, and this Barbie definitely delivers. She's amazing. So starting off with her face, it's really pretty. She has pretty blue eyes with a bit of green in them. And her makeup is very extravagant for the costume ball. It's green, pink, and blue with pink lips and blush and she has on some beautiful metallic pink earrings with a matching pink ring super pretty and her hair is so beautiful it's Kinecolon and it's blonde it's really curly it's really well done of course it's a little bit flat in the back because it's been in the box since 1990 so of course it's a little bit flat in the back but it is pulled up in the top here just like a little twist braid it's very pretty and it's very like 1990. It's very, so funny. Here's her dress. I'm going to try my best to describe it because like I'm not really good at describing like really big extravagant outfits like this. So here's the top which is it's really pretty iridescent white material that like shines greenish, purplish, pinkish, blue in the light as you can see. It's really pretty. And she also has this shawl I think it's called. And it's pink and ruffly, but it also doubles as a skirt, and I'll show you later. And here's Barbie's bottom half of the dress, which is ginormous, and it's, like, bigger than her. So, underneath all of that is this pink material, and then there's, like, two layers of pink tulle. And then this part here is actually a mask for you. You can remove it from Barbie's dress, give her a more simple look. And you can wear the mask to the costume ball, so you can go and look super pretty with Barbie. As for shoes, Barbie is wearing simple baby pink heels. She also comes with a little mask holder, which is in pink, and it has a little handle for her to hold. The mask she comes originally is silver, with lots of jewels on it. And it's to go with her ball gown look. But she also comes with two other masks to put on with her two other outfits. So let's change up her outfit, shall we? Let's turn her into a beautiful, graceful little butterfly. Wow, Barbie, you look so pretty. So here's her butterfly costume, which is so pretty. And it's definitely, obviously, a much more subtle look than her ball gown. 
so like as soon as you take off her dress part, like the skirt, underneath she has on this really pretty white and pink tulle roughly skirt. And then like the top part of her bodice like goes down in a V shape, which is super cute. And the mask that is for you can also double as the butterfly wings, which is super pretty. And she also has another mask, which is a butterfly to go with her costume, which is super cute. All right, Barbie, let's try one more look. Let's turn you into a fantasy flower. All right, here's Barbie's final look, which is the fantasy flower, and she looks so pretty, as beautiful as a rose. Her masquerade mask is also really pretty, with lots of flowers and stuff on it. And her costume is pretty much the same as the last one, minus the wings, of course, but she has the added on front frilly stuff down here, which is originally around her shoulders, as I told you before. So it's really pretty. I actually really, really like the way it looks. So yeah, this look is definitely one of my favorites. To make sure Barbie looks super fabulous and glamorous throughout the costume ball night, we have a per pink Barbie brush to brush out her beautiful long blonde hair. She also comes with three more cutouts, and I'm not exactly sure what they're for, so if you guys know, please let me know in the comments. But she comes with this tiara, flowers, and whatever this thing is. I'm not so sure what that is, but yeah. She also has an invitation to invite one of her friends to the ball. Maybe she'll invite Ken. She also comes with a little cardboard stand that you can like put together yourself and stuff. And I tried it and she does stand on it, but she also kind of doesn't, especially in her first outfit because it's so like, like big and she like falls over if you like leave her like that for a while. So I decided to just put her on like a normal doll stand instead of that one, but it's nice that they at least came with one, so that's cool. Well, Barbie, with looks like these, you're sure to be the belle at the ball. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my review on Costume Ball Barbie. I really, really like her. And tell me in the comments which look was your favorite. Fantasy flower, the butterfly, or the ball gown? Um, I personally can't decide. I think they're all so lovely. And also, as a bonus review, I am going to do a review on Selfie Snaps Yasmin from Bratz because I thought why not because here in Canada I don't know about you guys but it's the first day back at school after Christmas break and it's really like not everyone is happy about it I'm sure so I thought I would brighten up everyone's day with an extra bonus review so why not so stay tuned for that and until next time comment rate subscribe and see you in the next video bye guys